Hi, I'm Jeff Schumacher, co-founder of Pure Integrity Soy Candles, and today I'm here to show you natural ways to color candles. Most candles use a synthetic dye for color. I'm going to show you today how to use natural ingredients to add color to almost any candle. Here I have a coffee filter, some paprika, and just a string. We're going to pour the paprika into the coffee filter, as I show you here, and we're going to tie it off with a piece of string and tie it nice and tight because we are going to be adding this directly to the wax and we don't want any of it, any of the paprika actually seeping through or falling out and getting into the wax itself. Now we're going to need to put it in the wax and we want to really push it down and submerge it and then stir it up a little bit so we totally saturate the uh, paprika uh, and completely get it mixed into the wax. The wax needs to be somewhere between 160 and 180 degrees to draw as much color out of the paprika. The longer you leave it in there, the more color you're going to get, the brighter the candle will be. Now after we've had it in there for several hours minimum, we're going to remove the bag from the wax. And this can be a little messy, so I'm going to just lift it out here gently and I'm going to set it aside right on a paper towel. And then we're going to continue to stir the wax a little bit to make sure that the color is blended nicely. At this point, I'm going to let the wax just naturally cool slowly to the temperature that I'd like to pour at. Now we at Pure Integrity Candles typically are pouring our candles at around 110 degrees. Most people choose to pour around 130 degrees, but that's up to you. It is not quite as bold as synthetic colors. They're going to be a little bit more subtle, often a little pastel, but they are beautiful. Some other natural ingredients that would work very well with this technique are comfrey, rosehip powder, lavender, spirulina powder, and this is the way that they have colored candles for centuries.